Hello everybody, welcome to another exciting episode and Happy New Year's, Happy 2022. Today I'm going to show off Grimlock here and also Slug from the Dinobots. This is the 86 series that was released just recently. And I got these for Christmas and as you can see here is a close up of Grimlock. And it does have the Toy Hacks sticker upgrade. So if you go to toyhacks.com, you can get sticker upgrades. This was given to me and all done for me. So as you can see, the sticker hacks, the decals, they look really nice. It really makes the uh, figure shine. I will post pictures of what it looked like before, briefly. I just have a couple quick snaps of it. Now, as you can see, I usually do video game reviews. So this is going to be a little rough doing some figure reviews but this is going on the gaming shelves because i do collect other things besides video games and this was given to me so it's fantastic i had grimlock as a kid from the g1 series and now i have this version this 86 series it's been released and grimlock looks really cool he transforms really nice looks cool he's got wheelie with him on his shoulder there and then there's Daniel on Slug, as you can see. And he's pretty impressive also. His transformation, he transforms about half of his size. So that's pretty cool how he did. they did that. There's the back of him, as you can see, looking fantastic. I wish Daniel had a little bit more detail on the little minifigures that come with him on each side, Wheelie and him, but still really cool. And I really like it. Head sculpt is really nice. Now, as you can see, everything looks really good with the, the uh, sticker upgrades. So let me switch it over here. As you can see, every little detail. Now this is him transformed. I didn't do it on camera in person because I'm not very good at doing all these transformations, messing with it. Especially this one. This one's a little more complicated, more a little bit more. Uh, it takes a little more in-depth to transform him into his dinosaur mode compared to a Grimlock. So it took me quite a few tries to figure him out. But once you get used to him, it becomes easier. So as you can see, he looks like a fantastic figure. I really like him in his uh, dinosaur mode, Triceratops. Just looks really cool. And uh, the sticker hacks around the... Uh, I don't know what you call that fin around his head or what you call that thing. It looks really cool. And there is them side by side. As you can see how they're both about the same height. So when he transforms down into it's like transforms in dinosaur mode, they really shrink him down. So it looks really cool how you can see the size comparison of how tiny he gets when he transforms. Anyways, that is it for this episode. I am now going to add him to the shelf. I made room for him. And I have a few others to do, so I will show you those in the near future. And there it is on the shelf with the others up there. Even my Star Trek characters up there, Pez Dispenser. As you can see, I, I really like Soundwave up there. And lots of room to put other stuff up there. Anyways, that is it for this episode. I hope you liked it. Here is the pictures before the Toy Hacks sticker upgrades. Anyways, that is it for this episode. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and as always, have a good one.